What's happening, fam? LA All Movement Still Moves. Subscriber Doc Prime. You see the thumbnail. Baby daddies used to attack baby daddy. You see the Minister of Society reference, right? You see it. You see it. You see it. So here's the thing. Big problem. So you got guys who are baby daddies. Let's just start with the family first. So you might have a, 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 a cousin or a brother. And he's a baby daddy. And you're getting into it with your baby daddy. So then you, you call your cousin, your brother up to go check your baby daddy. Your cousin or brother already knows that you ain't that you're not an innocent party, but he decides, yeah, well, you know what I'm saying. He decides what this man can and cannot do, and what's over the line, right? Just with him, not with you, just with him. Now he goes to confront the guy, check a guy, and I'm I'm talking situations that can be completely talked out that are not over over overboard, right? But you go to check a guy and get in a fight with a guy. You might pull up on a guy, you know, whether it's just, you know, gun, knife, bat, whatever. And at the same time, you're a baby daddy. And guess what? You've had the altercations with somebody sending somebody to, quote unquote, check or discipline you. So it's like, so you can't, so, you, so it never dawns on you when we're having these interactions that, hey, I'm a baby daddy getting going on a mission to to disrespect or discipline the baby daddy, but it's very simple to me. You can't take it out on your baby mama. You can't take it out in the courts a lot of times. You, you know, you can't take it out on the police. So who's the only group that you could take it out on? Another baby daddy. So now that's who you're gonna go hard at. Because, you know, if you went at your baby mama, that's cancel culture, right? You go at the courts, it's a no-win situation, right? If you if you go at them with the same type of fervor and disrespect that they go at you with. So it's like, okay, who can I who can I take my shots? Who can I get my licks in on? Another baby daddy. Now, let's take this a little bit further. For you guys who are in relationships and you're a baby daddy. And your girlfriend wants you to check, your girlfriend, your woman, fiance, wife, whatever, wants you to check her baby daddy. While you're a baby daddy and you're telling her about the stuff that's going on between you and your baby mama. So, She says your baby mama ain't ish for the things that, that she does, but you're on a mission for her on stuff that your baby mama does that she ain't ish for. They both of y'all agree that she ain't ish for. So look at the hypocrisy in this. It just doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. It's like, so you send the baby daddies to attack baby daddies and, and, they, and they're not, and they don't even think about it. It, it doesn't even cross their mind like, bro, like, why am I here? Like, I'm here to beat you up. Is it you using baby daddies to attack other baby daddies? Guys who can't see their kids, <laughs> but they can help raise your kid, and they gonna fight for that. But they gonna fight you for actually wanting to see your kid. And then you gotta ask, okay. Um, are you staying with this these women? Like you need a place to stay or something? Cause this is this is this is taking the homosexual thing to a whole nother level. It's been like this for a very long time, mind you. You know, the, the thumbnail is from Minister Society. So it's been like this for a very long time. But let me take this one step further. How is it? That these women know that they can do this is because you, my friend, are more concerned about sex 
than right and wrong. You know, if you're dealing with a baby mama and her baby daddy, quote unquote, is on child support, and she's still giving him a rough time on seeing the kid, so y'all really can't spend time together because she's being controlling. And you can't spend time with your son or daughter because she's being controlling. But you're willing to wait, at, be at the front door to, to fight this guy and shoot this guy. And it ain't your child. Who's the, who's the, you're a sucker. This, this, you know, you're a super simp. You're a hypocritical super simp. Because I'm going, we're going, to, I'm going to go to war to make sure you don't see your baby. For this woman who says my baby mama a, a, a low down heifer for making sure I can't see my baby. Like, you're stupid, bro. Nobody else. You're stupid. You shouldn't even be able to be manipulated like this. Because you should see the situation, have some empathy, and go, you know what? This is happening to me. I'm not going to let it happen to you. And that's how it should go. But no, no. All so you can get betwixt them thighs. Stupidity. But I'm done. Like, share, subscribe, or die. Try and peace.